He starts as an amateur, doing Porsche club racing at local tracks, but is soon introduced to Horst Farnbacher, a professional race team owner. For years, the Horst team has won races in Europe, but the cost of owning such a team can be astronomical. A full season of racing in a single car requires somewhere between 800,000 to a million dollars to pay for the crew, to pay for the car. So that's not peanuts. The team decides to try its luck in America, but they need an additional investor. Greg Lowell's told us that he had a lot of money, that he wanted to take an active part in working with us. He invests, and the team becomes Farnbacher Lowell's. Farnbacher Lowell's ran very well. Every race we were competitive, and we won many races. Lowell's doesn't stop there. Under his new Farnbacher Lowell's entity, he also decides to build a new business, an amateur race car servicing center in Danbury, Connecticut. He took members of the community there to see it for the grand opening. Facility was top of the line. It was impressive. I looked up and I said, this place will never make money. Spencer Cox has been operating his own servicing business for years, but agrees to come work for Lowell's at his new facility. It was beautiful, but it was the Taj Mahal. The rent was insane. We had porters and helpers and office staff. This industry doesn't generate this kind of money. Where's the money coming from? He said he was a hedge fund guy. We figured he just had deep pockets. He does. They're just not his. American Greed Mondays, premiere episodes, 10 Eastern, CNBC. Get yours. Hey, CNBC fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Here you'll find videos from all your favorite CNBC shows. Be sure to subscribe by clicking right here. Click on the videos around me and watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.